is my drone. I'm going to fly it under bridges, around trees, close to the ground, and you can't say anything because it's mine. It's fantastic. It's so nice. Hi, I'm Katie. And I'm Scott. And a couple years ago, we gave up our single parent lifestyle when we fell in love, got married, and had a baby. And now while most of our friends are celebrating empty nests, we're starting over, but this time we'll be older and wiser. Hopefully. Hopefully. Hey guys, I'm here with a new toy. <laughs> I say toy because this is the DJI Mavic Mini. This is not a technical review. Um, I'm not a technical person, but we got a new drone and I'm really excited about it for a few very important reasons. Number one, this thing is tiny. It's super duper small, so we're gonna be able to take it out on our adventures, hiking, biking, scaling mountains, falling into waterfalls, you know, the little things. <laughs> so, a couple really cool things about this. DJI kept this under 250 grams in a lot of places, 250 grams is where you have a lot of federal regulations and things like that. This is sitting at 249, so they got, uh, they got crafty with it, and I appreciate that. <laughs> uh, another thing is that this is supposed to be super easy to fly, so I can do it. And third thing, it's not that terribly expensive. Um, so this is kind of my drone now. This is mine, this is my baby. And I'm really excited to open the box and see what's inside. Okay, let's open it up. All right, what do we have? We have an adorable little case, DJI Mavic. Let's see here, we have a couple other little boxes in here. Little boxes. Even more little boxes. And, oh, that's heavy. That must be the battery. So this one is the Fly More Combo. So I think it comes with an extra battery or two extra batteries. Let's find out. Okay, I wanna look in this case first because I think that's where my drone is. Yep, oh, it's so cute. Look at how tiny, oh, it's so light. <gasps> wow. This is adorable, oh my gosh. And seriously, it's like I'm not holding anything in my hand, it's super duper light. Oh, it's so cute. Let's see, this might be the controller. So, I mean, you use your phone to control it, but this is where your phone goes. So, yep, that's what this is. So, little, these little things pop out like that. And you've got your little antennas right here. And you slide your phone. Oh, actually, I have it right here. Slide your phone right into there, although that's not really gonna work with my phone case on, so. That's a bummer. I wish they made these adjustable for that, but that's okay. What else do we have in the little case? Let's see, battery charger maybe? Yep, battery charger. These batteries are definitely different than the big drones. Let's see what we have. And, oh, little tiny things. <laughs> Little itty bitty things. These might be the uh, the cords and adapters for the different phones and things. Let's see. Yeah. So these are your adapter cords to connect your phone to the controller. All kinds of little tiny. <laughs> Little, they all have QR codes on them too. I point out QR codes now because I told Scott like a year ago, nobody uses QR codes for anything and everybody does. So I always point that out because I can admit when I was wrong. Here are the little, um, the little joysticks for your controller. Gosh, it's so cute. 
this on there. Ta-da! See? La, 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 la. Oh, look, there's more. Look, they have them right there. <laughs> I didn't even realize that. Okay, that's fun. Okay, so cords and stuff. Absolutely wonderful. That was in that box. Um, let's see what's in here. Power brick. Batteries, probably. This is heavy. I mean, it's not like crazy heavy, but compared to everything else, I think this actually weighs more than my drone. My drone. Yep, batteries. One, two, and three. Well, I want to see what these look like. Okay. That's super easy. And I would imagine that I'm going to go ahead and take these stickers off. You got little stickers keeping the adorable little propellers closed. I would imagine this is where the battery goes. Yep. Gosh. See, I don't even have to read the directions. I will read the directions. But for right now, I don't have to. So that's the back. And you just lift that up. And your battery just slides right in there like that. And then you click it into place, which I'm not going to do yet because I want to read the directions. All right, um, hey look, directions. <laughs> okay, I'm all about it. And QR codes. Oh look, a handy little yes and no checklist right there. You get quite a few directions. Quick start guide, which is the first thing I will do. And what, oh these are probably the Prop guards. Yep. I'll put that down there. Prop guards for when you're going to fly under bridges, through tunnels, and around trees, which I'm totally going to do. Okay. So, I'm going to just take all the things off. There's little propellers under here. Hmm, all right. Oh, no, okay. This has to go, I know how to do this because it's almost exactly like the big one. So these flip out and then these flip down and under. And there it is. So this could totally fit in a pocket or a camera bag. And I just got a new camera carrier that has a little hip thing that goes with it for pouches and things so this can fit in there while I'm hauling the other camera. There's your, your cord and your memory card slot right there. So super cute. Now I think the big thing is what am I going to name it? Well I guess I need to charge it up and go fly it now. DJI Mini. This is the first flight, <laughs> which means I have to find the app and turn it on. What do I do first? Do I like the app up or do I, you know what? I'm just gonna find the app. Okay, there it is. It's the DJI Fly app. It was just updated at midnight. It's located me already. And now, <laughs> it's so cute. Okay, oh. Let's see here. Is the battery already in here? No. All right. Let's see. I flip this out. And I flip this out. And I flip that up. And I flip that up. And I take this off. Look at me remembering to take the case off or the cover off. Now, I'm going to put a battery in. A little batteries. Um, Got to figure out how to get them out of here first. I think I flipped this up. No, no. I'm gonna break it. How do I get the batteries out? Is there a, is there a way? <laughs> You're gonna make me do this all on my own? Oh, wait a minute, something's happening. Something is happening. Do you just, ha <laughs> I got it. <laughs> okay, battery. 
goes in the back here. There's my connector, so it goes up like that. Click that down. There's no card in here. Where's the card at? Did you forget a card? Do that. Okay. We good? You put your little, little tiny micro memory card in here. Oh good, it shows me how it goes in there. That's nice. Push it right in there. Okay. I'm gonna assume that this is the power button and it probably goes on just like the big one. Oh yeah, all right, okay. Yeah, I can't wait to see it fly too. In a little bit, bud, I'm not quite there yet. Okay, this is my controller. All right. These get flipped out. These little joysticks are right there and they get twisted on. Ooh, fancy, okay. Um, this phone gets shoved in here. <laughs> Hopefully. Oh, that's neat. Oh, do I have to plug this in with a cord? Oh, I do. Hmm, okay. I should have done that first. I didn't know. Aircraft resetting wireless network settings to match local, yes, okay. Aircraft not connected. Talk to each other. Communicate. It is registering server. Done. Aircraft is activated. All right, go fly. Beginner flight tutorial. I don't need a tutorial. Okay, I can see what my little drone sees here. Okay, I'm gonna do this now. Here we go. Take off. Take off. Oh, you have to hold down the little button. Oh, it's so cute. Ooh, it's fast. It is fighting those winds. Oh, it's so pretty. Come, come look. Can look I at try that. Flying Such a please? clear picture. Can wow. I try? Can I try to fly it? Look at that. It's still hard mode. Strong wind. It's telling me to land. It's really too hard. Why is it telling you to land? Because it's telling me that there's too much wind. Okay, yes, we have sustained winds of 14 miles an hour. And the, uh, whoa, that is not me. I'm not, I'm not touching the controller, but this little guy is kind of doing a little jig here in the wind. Um, so I don't know what our wind gusts are now. It would be nice to have the altimeter out. Okay. Should be good here. So the maiden voyage, <laughs> um, we will have to wait for a slightly calmer day to really let me do some loop de loops and fly it through things and under things and around things and really make Scott freak out. Uh, Mom, will you be able to fly under Daddy's track? I bet I can. Okay, so this thing is fun to fly. It really is. It's super fast. It's very maneuverable, very responsive, does not like wind, <laughs> but at this weight, I mean, the battery's even in here and it, it feels like there's nothing in my hand. So I wouldn't expect it to do well in the wind. Um, I 
love this thing. It's gonna be a fantastic addition to the rest of my photography gear. It's gonna fit just right in my camera bag. I'm a professional photographer, so I have a little bit of space left in my, in my gear bag. You can check out some behind the scenes photos from a photo shoot that we did. Um, also, I love the camera technology. So um, another video I did is pitting my brand new iPhone 11 Pro against my Nikon DSLR. Check that out, it was a lot of fun. So check out the rest of our channel, subscribe, hit the little bell icon so you get notified when we upload new videos every single week. Leave us a comment and tell us what you thought. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.